for the tangent to the curve this one at the point this one passes through this one find the value of k so here we have y is equal to x minus 2 square at point 3 1 so here we can expand before we differentiate so x becomes x square so 2 times negative 2 times x we get negative 4x and this one we get plus 4 so this one is actually a minus b square which is equal a square minus 2ab plus b square so the first term you square this one the second term you multiply 2 negative b and a and the last one you just square your b this is the easier way for you to expand okay so you have y then you can differentiate so you get 2x minus 4 so this one is the gradient of tangent so this one is a gradient of tangent so we have the point 3 1 so we can find what is our gradient at this particular point so here when x is equal to 3 dy over dx is equal to 2 3 minus 4 which is equal to 6 minus 4 which is equal to 2 so we know that the gradient is equal to 2 so m is equal to 2 and the point that we have is 3 1 so we can make equation from this one so y minus y1 is equal to m x minus x1. So y minus y1 is 1, m is 2, x minus x1 is equal to 3. So y minus 1 is equal to 2x, 2 times negative 3, negative 6. y is equal to 2x minus 6 plus 1 which is equal to 2x minus 5. So this one is the equation of tangent. So, equation of tangent, y is equal to 2x minus 5. So, here passes through k7. So, we know that this line is passing through this one. So, when passing through this one, so that means y is equal to 2x minus 5 and you have k7. So, it's passing through this point. So, we know what is our y. Then, we can find our x. So, this one is xy. So here we can substitute 7 is equal to 2 x is k minus 5. 7 is equal to 2 k minus 5. 2 k is equal to, so this one we bring to this left. 7 plus 5 is 12. k is equal to 6. B the normal to the curve, this one intersect x axis at A. So we know that when we find dy over dx, it is actually tangent. But then to get this one is gradient of tangent. But we know that to get the gradient of normal, m1, m2 is equal to negative 1. Because normal and tangent is perpendicular to each other. So m2 is equal to negative 1 divided by m1. Okay, this is how we get the gradient of normal. Okay, but never mind, we have to do dy over dx first. So here y is equal to 7x minus 6 over x when x is equal to 1. To differentiate, we need to bring the power up. So this one, this one is actually power of 1 when we bring up. So x negative 1. So we can differentiate. 7x becomes 7. So this one. We bring the power front, negative 1 times 6, you get negative 6. So x, and then we minus the power with 1. So this one you can also directly write as positive. So 7 plus 6x, negative 2, 7 plus 6 over x square. So this one is the gradient of tangent. So we can find gradient of tangent at 1. So when x is equal to 1, dy over dx is equal to 7 plus 6, 1 square, which is equal to 7 plus 6, which is equal to 13. Okay, we know that the gradient of tangent is 13. So the gradient of normal, m2 is equal to negative 1 divided by 13, which is equal to negative 1 over 13. So this one, m2 is equal to negative 1 over 13. Intercept as axis at A, find the coordinate of A. So now we have the gradient of normal. So we know we need to have the line because we know intercept x axis that means this one is zero because when we intercept x axis, y is zero, right? 
But then, we need to have an equation. To have equation, we need to have x and y. So, we can take y, we can take the coordinate to form equation here. So, x is equal to 1. So, here, when x is equal to 1, y is equal to 7, 1 minus 6 over 1. So, here, 7 minus 6. So, you get 1, which is 1, 1. So, the equation is y minus y1 is equal to mx minus x1. So, y minus y1 is 1. So, it is x and y is equal to so m is negative 1 over 13 x minus x1 is 1 so y minus 1 is equal to negative 1 over 13 x so negative 1 over 13 times negative 1 you get positive 1 over 13 so y is equal to negative 1 over 13 x so this one would be plus 1 over 13 so negative when we bring to the right we get positive 1 so this one Okay, not enough space. So here y is equal to negative 1 over 13x. So 1 over 13 plus 1, you get 14 over 3. So this is the equation of normal. So we know that intercept x exists at A. So here when is equal to 0, then here 0 is equal to negative 1 over 13x, so this one is 14 over 13 so plus 14 over 13 so then, we can multiply everything with 13 to remove the denominator, so this one times 13, we get 0 back so this one is negative x plus 14, so x is equal to 14 so x is equal to 14 so coordinate of a is 14 Zero.